Hey, you guys like this new music I got? Um, it's called Funk. Funk. Tribes Funk. Um, yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good music. So, what is our plan today? We're gonna be going for Mr. Mr. Buccaneer Paragon. And yeah, this is gonna be our fourth one. And we're gonna see how far he could go. So, we're gonna put Geraldo like in the middle there and we'll put a dart monkey just above him so with that being said we're just gonna save up for our farms and maybe we'll try to get this quincy action figure because that thing's pretty op so we might need more defense um i guess i can put like one of those shooty turret thingies right next to the dart monkey because uh we were leaking a little bit but hopefully we're okay now so I think we're okay. We got like the shooty turret, and then we got the dart monkey, and then we got Geraldo. That's pretty OP. Um, I just want to farm, so if I die because I'm greedy, then don't be greedy. Alright, so I'll put a boat down, and that should be like good enough, hopefully, to not let us die. We can put another like shooty turret down there, and then that should just like hold us off. So we'll need like faster shooting. And then we'll need we'll need the destroyer. That's what we'll. <sighs> you know what? We're just gonna restart. That was a bad run. All right. So what we have done is we moved Gerald over here, and then we have our dirt monkey up there. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a wall of fire up in the front here. And yeah, I guess that's the plan. Um, I'm gonna just go straight up for the wall of fire because um, we cannot defend like these guys suck at defending They gotta like buff Geraldo's damage to like, I don't know make it so he can pop like a Moab in one hit Like off of level one. I feel like that's fair because like Geraldo, you know He costs 600 a place. So I feel like that would be essentially fair um, <laughs> um but yeah, here we go. We're about to grab our 022 wizard monkey. And now we're just going to continue farming. Because now, I'm not scared. Oh my god. He cannot pop. He cannot pop. Freaking purple balloons. Oh my god. You know what? We'll just put three shooty turrets up here. Yeah. Now what? Now what, huh? Exactly. Alright, hopefully, hopefully our defense is good now, everything's okay, and we're just gonna farm. Yeah, we're, we're just gonna farm, everything will be a-okay. Alright, so it's round 36, I think what we're gonna do is just set up a ton of boats here, like this, and then we'll go, like, we'll just keep putting them across, so... Then everything will be a-okay. Um, there we go. So, obviously these boats are not going to be enough defense. But uh, we're going to go for a early destroyer here to kill the Moab. And I think that's I think that's all we're going to do. We're going to go like an early destroyer here. Um, should we make him see... Um, I don't know. Does Destroyer give you more range? It doesn't. I'm gonna go longer range just so we can pop that Moab and then everything will be A okay. So I'm gonna get rid of that and I think we'll be okay now. So maybe, maybe we could pop it. Um, let's see. Boom, 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 boom. Destroyer's OP, right? Destroyer's OP, right? Uh, we got one pink balloon got by. That's okay. So I think what I'm gonna do is start getting these to marketplaces, start getting merchantmen, and all of the above. All right. So once we have what we have, what eight, 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 um, eight, uh, marketplaces. Yep. Okay. Uh, we're gonna start getting merchantmen. So here we go. We'll probably fill up this entire lake, but I want to have my three maxed out boats at the end of this right here, just so I can like boost them with an elk in the village. And just make them stronger. So these guys are gonna be our fifth tiers back here. Um, we'll have an elf back here. So um, we'll go like this. 
and we'll go longer range and then we'll go like this and we'll go grip shot because grip shots op and now we just need merchant man a lot of money and we don't have quincy so that's kind of sad we can always sell geraldo i think but i don't know i don't want to do that so we're just gonna put down a lot of merchant men and hopefully we don't die because this defense should be pretty good I'm gonna, I might have to get grip shot on each of these merchantmen just so they can be helpful. But yeah, for now I'll see you guys. I don't know. I'll probably, maybe, I I'll see you guys at round 80 probably. So we are starting to leak on round 63, um, which makes sense. It is one of the stronger rounds. So what we're gonna do is start getting our aircraft carrier, um, and he's gonna help us out tremendously. We're gonna grab an Alp right here, and we're just gonna go 5-2-0 on him eventually. Um, and we gotta start getting our boats here, huh? We gotta get our boat farming going. So maybe I just start selling these and grab a trade empire. Um, yeah, I guess I could start selling these, grab the trade empire, and then that's just gonna make us really OP. So. I think with this being said, I'll see you guys on round 80. Alright, so since we're making so much money, I'm gonna just grab the carrier flagship here. I should probably put the alchemist there instead, right? Yeah. Yeah, that would be way better. Alright, so we'll put that there instead. And then can I put a village there? Because that'd be crazy. No, I can't. Um, So we'll sell the elk. And then we'll go like here if i can you not put a village here that was the entire plan all right so we'll put it like right there and then we'll go like two five zero that's gonna be pretty good and since all our boats are up there now what we want to do is we want to start grabbing these zero two five farms zero two four whatever we just want to start grabbing these because they make way more money than the top half so zero two four there we go uh can i actually put two here if i can like like boom and then uh, boom we got two okay so with that being said um i'll see you guys around 80. so actually I didn't even notice that we beat round 80 because it happened so fast. Um, can I put like another farm here? No, I can't. I, ah, who cares? We'll go like this and then I think that that will be all. So we'll go one more and then look at all our boats. They're going to get crazy pops as long as they got some upgrades, right? Yeah, everything's okay. So. I think what I'm going to do, hmm, I do want to use this fertilizer, so I might grab, like, I don't know, like, the boat farming strat's cool and all, but, like, you know, I don't want to make more than just boats, um, but maybe we could just leave it at boats, because boats are pretty cool every once in a while, switch it up, so yeah, I guess I'll just do marketplaces this game, and we're going to grab Monkey Wall Street, we might grab the perm brew. We might grab that. Actually, I'm gonna max the pirate lord. And what we're gonna do is grab a. I put this somewhere where we won't. Yeah, I'll grab that. I'm gonna put it on the pirate lord so he can get some pops going. And that's gonna be good. So I'm just gonna farm, start grabbing our totem soon, and I will see you guys later. So I bought Quincy's action figure for only a small price of 180k and now I'm just gonna put more totems. We've already started doing them. We maxed Geraldo early. I'm gonna start putting these little um, sharpening stones on our boats so they get more pops. And overall, we're doing really good. Marketplaces are really good for what I'm trying to accomplish here. Um, I just hope we don't die and we shouldn't. I'm gonna sell this wizard monkey. He's been really helpful, but like, he's taking away the pops. 
so I'm also gonna get rid of this dart monkey. He has 1k pops, bro. Come on now. And yeah, this should be this should be all we need to get to the promised land. And I just gotta start putting more totems. And hopefully we can get our earliest 100 degree paragon yet. I didn't notice that our guys do struggle with DDTs. Um, so what I'm gonna do is use our aircraft carrier and I'm gonna go for a zero wait that's not it that's not it I wanna go with a zero two five so that we can get that super glue and he's not gonna get pops right why is he getting pops how is he getting pops I I don't want him to get pops but like hmm. I don't don't know how I feel about this so, I guess I'm gonna just put more totems to make myself feel better. But huh. Anyways, I'm gonna put some jalapenos on these guys because I think it actually increases their pops. Um, I could be wrong, but I'm gonna just do it because jalapenos are cool. And I don't know. He's actually gaining pops. I don't. I don't know if I like that. I might have to sell him. So what I'll do is I'll sell him, and then in the back we could put like super mines just in case so i guess that's the plan and then we'll just grab more totems so i will see you guys at probably like round 150 so i think what i'm gonna do because we're nearing on that degree 100 um what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna replace you with this boat instead that why did i grab why what am i doing all right, let me only to the fourth tier and then we'll make this one the fifth tier because it's right in the middle. So it's going to go crazy and yeah, that should be good. So I think we'll, if we just play like that, everything will be A-OK. -okay. So I think what I'm going to do, is, where's Geraldo? There he is. I'm going to put a jalapeno on our new trade empire that I just put. I just bought a jalapeno on the power totem. I, okay, yep, mm-hmm. So, we are almost there. I'll see you guys when we have degree 100. All right, here we go. Let's see it. Let's see if this guy is the one. Let's divert to the seas. Here we go. 99. Okay, bye guys. I, uh... I hate, I hate it. I hate it here, man. Okay, guys, is the moment of truth. You know what? We we'll might as well sell the Quincy action figure. And we have two mil, and here we go. The neighbor of the seas. Degree 100, right? I hate it. I. Oh my god. Okay, guys. Let's, um, let's try this one more time. So, just like that. There we go okay of course third try is the best try right so we're going to set that up to the monkey buccaneer we have our little tech bot set on him and we're just gonna let it run we have nothing else on the map right i'm looking i don't see anything so i think we're good and how much just let this run and hopefully it beats round 200 which is where the ninja monkey paragon fell so let's go um actually before we go, I do want to look at him, right? So, of course, the Monkey Buccaneer has the carrier flagship, except the planes are multiplied, like the Pierce is way stronger. Um, his ability sucks in DDTs and BADs, so that's why he's one of the strongest Paragons. And then, he also makes you money, I think. I, I don't know. I'm pretty sure he does. So, let's wait for the round to end, and we'll see if it makes money. I've never actually looked at that. Does it, he does. He makes you about 3k. I'm not sure where the skills off of, but it does make you a lot of money. So I guess you could just keep boat farming because he's OP. And yeah, I guess that's all you have about him. The fact that he just sucks up bad though is just crazy to me. So he he might make it way past round 200. So let's see what this guy's capable of. Sorry, uh, sorry guys, I was eating some apples, but 
Looks like it falls at round 198, and round 198 is two rounds below the Ninja Paragon. So the Ninja Paragon is a lot stronger than you guys might actually think, because it lost to the Monkey Buccaneer Paragon. Paragon? Par Paragon. But yeah, wow. I thought the Monkey Buccaneer was going to be the strongest one, or make it to the, like, wow. I thought it was going to be, like, the best. But the Ninja one's actually better. Okay. That's amazing to know. Wow. Um... And of course, if you guys enjoy this, make sure you hit the like button, hit that sub button, and leave a comment down below. I always respond. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.